Carolina State University is seeing a surge in applications leading to questions of if there will be enough housing to meet the demand. That's right, because this comes as the university is planning to cut housing availability this fall semester with one residential building set to be closed for renovations. Jalen Tart reports. It's a good problem, but it's one that's manageable. Dr. Manicia Finch, South Carolina State's Vice President for Enrollment Management, spoke on the rising growth of student enrollment. Since 2022, applications and enrollment figures are up at South Carolina State. In fact, enrollment between 2022 and 2023 is up nearly 15 percent. Applications for the upcoming fall semester are up 29 percent over last year. You know, freshmen are guaranteed housing because we want to make sure that their first year that they can maneuver the campus and maneuver the city. So they're going to be on campus regardless. But a lot of our upperclassmen are going to be on campus too as well. So as a, as a resurgence of enrollment comes, the preparation is coming too. Because of the limited housing, the university plans to cap the number of freshmen admitted into the next school year at 1,000. For comparison, over 1,200 new students were enrolled last year. The university has launched a new housing registration system called STARES, which will allow the Office of Residence Life and Housing to track applications and placements. They have to be cleared financially which means that they can't owe money for last fall and this spring before they can apply for housing for the fall. So there are things that they need to do prior to even applying so that we don't have students who are taking rooms who maybe should not even have a room. Thompson says students can also track the progress of their applications through the registration system. Dr. Finch hopes that with the growth in enrollment could lead to additional resources in the future. I just want to see us flourish and our, our flourishing be well recognized uh, across uh, state boundaries that we get additional resources uh, and not have to work so hard when well, we're working hard already internally to manifest the enrollment. The university asked students to apply to SARS early. Officials plan to have rooms assigned by June 3rd. Reporting in Orangeburg, Jalen's Hart, WIS News 10.